In this video, I'm going to show you how to add end screen templates to your videos on YouTube. YouTube Simplify. Hi, and welcome to Creator Fundamentals. My name is Dan Courier, and it is my mission to simplify YouTube so you and I can grow together. And if you want to continue to simplify YouTube, make sure you click that subscribe button and the bell notification icon so you don't miss a thing. All right, so if you're looking to add end screens to your videos, you have come to the right place. There's a variety of different ways to do that. This is going to focus on a specific way to maximize viewership on your channel. So stick around. I'm going to show you exactly how to add the template to your video, how to upload that video to YouTube, and then how to apply the end screen elements to that template. And the best part is, if you stick around to the end of this video, I'm going to give you a free template pack that has over 50 free end screen templates for you to use. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do is jump into the video editor to see how you go about adding the end screen template to your video. All right, so the first thing you need to do is go into your editor, edit your video like you normally would, and just before you save it, uh, we're gonna do a little adjustment at the end. Now this is gonna work with any uh, editor that allows you to do layers. Premiere Pro is my editor of choice, but there are a number of different options out there that will work. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the end of the video. Now, a couple things when you're ending your video, don't give too much lead time on ending your video. Try to make it as quick and succinct as possible because you don't wanna give that early cue that people uh, should bail from your video. All right, so there's your video, but we have chopped it where we wanna start it, okay? So now we're basically at the conclusion of our video. We're gonna go in and import, and then you can go in to the end screen template pack, which contains over 50 templates that you can choose from. And we're just going to pick one here. What do I wanna do? Uh, obviously you're gonna pick one that works best with your brand, but for this point, I'll just grab one. All right, and then we're gonna drag that over the last clip. Okay, so we go here, we make it the same size as the last clip, and as you can see, of course the video is behind it so you don't see anything. So you take that end of the video that you uh, clipped and you put it on top so that you can see it. And then you select the video and resize it. And as you can see, you can start to see how this all comes together. This square in the upper right hand corner is where you put your video right here. And then it has little indicators for where you put your subscribe button in the next video to watch. In this case, it would be your right side. And uh, you're actually looking like you're pointing at the video and giving them a very specific path to take at the conclusion of each video. And now we're gonna jump over to YouTube to show you how to use YouTube Studio and the YouTube Video Editor to add the end screen elements to your end screen. Now I've uploaded that video onto Dad's Tech Advice just so we can show you exactly how you go about using that template in the editor. So you have your video up here, come in here, we'll edit it. We'll go into the YouTube editor, and now we have to actually add the end screen elements that YouTube provides. Now, the easiest way to do this is to try to click towards the very end of the video, use your cursor to kind of get a sense of where that end screen starts and finishes. Now, I think YouTube will give you up to 20 seconds for the end screen element. Um, personally, I would never go more than 10. I think this one is even less than that but we'll get our cursor generally, and then we'll just zoom in a little bit so it's just easier to see what's going on here. And what we'll do is we'll click on this little plus right here to add end screen element. I'll add a playlist. I'll go in here and select the only playlist this channel has. You can see it puts it over here. We're gonna put it generally over there for a minute, and then we also want our subscribe button, and it's gonna be generally over there. So then we let this play until it gets there. Okay, so. Now, oh, I put that in the wrong place, but I'll show you it here in a second. So we want to get to right when this starts, which you can kind of see by the audio down here that it kind of kicks off right about there, right there. Looks like it starts right there. So the first thing you want to do is grab your end screen elements and you move your cursor over to the edge of them so it's just an arrow in each direction and you trim those down so they start right at that marker, okay? And then put the cursor back in there, you'll see those, and then you can take them and use those little silhouettes that we've included on the template to put everything where it goes. 
nice. But this is actually, this square is designed to make this the max size that it allows you to stretch to. So just do that instead of trying to see exactly where the box is. And that's all there is to it. And the best thing is uh, that pack is free. Free end screen template pack by clicking on the link in the description below. And you can choose from over 50 end screen templates for your videos. And hey, don't forget this video has been sponsored by TubeBuddy. TubeBuddy is your number one browser plugin for managing and growing your YouTube channel. It's available to download for free. There's a link in the description below or you can go to trytubebuddy.today and get started for free. And hey, don't forget there's a link in the description below to download those end screen templates templates. And hey, as part of this video, I'm including a limited offer. For a very short time, I am going to offer you the ability to take my mini course that includes the 50 templates plus goes more in depth through video to explain to you how to use these templates plus make adjustments so you can make your own custom templates. If you want to take advantage of this offer for less than $5, click on the link in the description below. And hey, don't let the learning stop here. If you want to see even more videos on YouTube feature tutorials, click the playlist to my right and also if you haven't subscribed yet click that round button below and be sure to ring the bell so you don't miss future videos that can help you simplify YouTube. I'll see you in the next video.